I'm gonna attempt to do AI's hardest Minecraft challenges. Each challenge gets harder and harder as we go on. Can I be AI's hardest Minecraft challenges? Well, let's find out. Give me three of your hardest Minecraft challenges. Let's see what happens. Yeah, let's do Super Flash Survival. Here we go, Chad. So I put the world type to Super Flash and boot up the world. I then went on a couple hundred blocks on fur until I found a village. I gathered the wood that was there, made a wooden pickaxe, grabbed some cobblestone, and made the necessary tools that I needed. I also killed the iron golem that was there and grabbed the iron. I made the iron into an iron bucket and grabbed some water. Before I headed off to find another village, I grabbed the hables that was there and made some food. After a couple hundred blocks later, I found another village. Oh, yippee, we got another one. After that, I killed the iron golem to get more iron. And soon enough, I found a little friend. Um, if I can find a horse. <gasps> yes! Be friends with me. Be hey, let's go. I also found a blacksmith, which inside I found some armor for the horse. Oh, and not just that. The chats decided to name an Oreo. Don't you think it's a good name? <laughs> After that, I made the iron that I had to make some iron buckets and grab the lava. This was all part of my plan. Because if I could get enough lava, I could make a nether portal. Before I went to another village to get more lava, I found something interesting. Why, why is there... Wait, I hear a zombie. Above, maybe? Grab the lava, I will, I will. Whoa! That was a lot of bats. These guys are just chilling. I then went to village to village getting iron for iron buckets to grabbing the lava that was there. Before you know it, I had almost just enough to go to the nether. All I needed was one blacksmith. But after countless hours of searching villages, I was doubting myself. Oh, uh, this sucks, dude. This sucks. But it was not going to stop me. I kept pushing myself until I found this. Come on, please. Oh, stop. Wait, hold the phone. I then made a staircase so that Oreo can go to the stronghold with me. I put Oreo in the 2x2 two two hole, built the nether portal, and went in. Alright, it's time, Chads. Actually, not that far. That's... Whoa! Chillax! Oh my gosh! Yes! After finding that, I made my way to the fortress. I found the blaze spawner, got as much blaze rods that I needed. After that, it was time to get out of there as soon as possible. What the heck is that? Ow, 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 ow. What? I'm dead, I'm dead. No! No! What? No armor challenge. Now let's get to it, chat. Since I spawned in the spruce forest, I grabbed some berry bushes for food and instantly found a village. I quickly killed the iron golem to get some free iron so I can make a shield and iron bucket so then I can grab some water. I also found some iron and an iron pickaxe in a villager's house, which was pretty since I couldn't wear any armor and had gotten pretty much the tools that I needed. I made my way to find a lava pool, which soon enough, I did. So I made the nether portal and before I went in the nether, I boxed myself in like a fish and quit the game. Nah, I'm just kidding. I got some food from some animals and then I finally went in. Gotta be the worst biome of all time. I'm just somehow surviving by just the skin of my teeth. Hi! Don't bother me! Get out of my face! Uh oh. Okay, I think we're chill. I think we're chill. I think we're chill. After that, I found the nether fortress. And even after that, I came across the blaze spawner too. There's one right there. I then proceeded to make a trap for the blazes, which eventually I finally get enough blaze rods. So I got out of there as soon as possible. Now, all I needed was to get some ender pearls to go to the end. So after finding a warped forest, I got out as much ender pearls that I could find and made it out safely. Hey, let's go. We're back in business chat. I then made the eyes of ender through it and proceeded to follow it until I'd finally found the stronghold. Which then, I'd also find the end portal room too. I then put the Isaander in and went in. Okay, here we go. No. Oh my gosh. We can't mess up now. Oh my gosh. No! Totally nothing happened. That's all, chance. Let's do it. Him with a ready, chance. It's finally the end. Oh my gosh! Totally legit. <laughs>
Give me your hardest challenge. No tools mode. Let's do it. Like every usual run. I grabbed some wood and considering we can't use any tools, the only thing I could make was a boat. Luckily, I found a shipwreck that had some iron and a buried treasure in it. I then made an iron bucket to grab some water and after, I followed the map until I found the treasure, which had even more iron in it. So then I made a shield and started to head it off to find a lava pool. Once I did, I made the nether portal and went in. Oh, yippee. That's exactly what I wanted. I don't like this biome. I made my way until I said this. Boat time, here we go. Hopefully I don't do that. Well, that's, that's one way of ending the video.